what's going on youtube come back at you with another video so 50 cent going back at wendy williams they've had some history in the past um 50 i thought was gonna lay off her but apparently he's not happy she's talking about him um so 50 disses her he said this bitch didn't i tell her not to put me on her show till she talk about being the world's most famous side bitch get the strap and actually i don't know it's, i seen i was going through the comments on this video there's a lot of people asking about who wendy williams was an alleged side bitch too um i'm gonna post that video for you where wendy was talking about who it is and i think it'll be news to a lot of people because like i said in these comments there's a lot of people wondering exactly what 50 is talking about well stay tuned i'm gonna um i'm gonna let you listen to it i definitely appreciate you watching if you haven't subscribed to my channel already please go ahead and do so peace hold on hold on Please, ladies and gentlemen, I'm the leader. You're, you are upsetting my patient here. Come on now, come on out. Just Sorry. let it all out. He Sorry, Doctor. Give it the time. The little ponytail, all that gold jewelry, the Ooh. stinky gold yeah. front. Yeah, I know, I know. How you doing? You got, <laughs> no, no. You got cold. I know. I understand. Gay. Come on. Oh, okay. How you doing? <laughs> <laughs> that was that was Eric. Here's I mean, the thing. Here's right. the thing, and we all go through this. Um, first of all. I never had a home number. It was always pagers. Okay. That, mm -hmm. That's the first thing. All right. And mind you, we, we know what that means. like over a year. Of course, he had other women. Mm -hmm. now, now, mind you, this was probably eight years ago. Okay. And eight years ago, I was still on top of my game in the radio career. Mm -hmm. So I really can't figure out why I was this stupid. You know, I was making pretty decent money and all like, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. I was queen of the radio, right, and I don't right. know why you're I still, You're still it. our queen of radio. Of course I am. Yes, you are. But I'm just saying, it started a long time ago. Mm -hmm. And it, back then, I'm trying to build this up, Luke, to say that it wasn't like I was like some scrub. No, 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 you're never going to be a scrub. No, you're never a scrub. Okay, so girls, and Luke and Dee Lee, <laughs> uh, I only took his pager number because that's all he would give me. So obviously he was cheating on me. That's the first thing. Mm -hmm. the second thing is that although we used to have good times together and go out on some great dates and stuff, mm -hmm. a lot of his visits to my apartment would be like after 2 o'clock in the morning oh. and I would just accept it because the rapper's in the studio. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. But I also know that they, they use that a lot in terms of cheating. Right. Because it wasn't you, it wasn't you. It was it was them. It, it was absolutely, him. and that's why I don't blame myself. No, and I'm can't. glad I went through this. You cannot blame yourself. And the third thing, and probably the most vile thing, is is that he never used condoms, and I accepted that. Yeah, it, it wasn't you. Because you you were full, you were fully into the relationship. You know, Luke, I don't know what I was fully into, and I wasn't fully into the relationship like that because I always knew that I never wanted to be with a rapper on that level. And I don't know, you know, maybe there was just like an air of excitement or something like that. You know, we used to jet to Atlantic City and go mm. out to Las Vegas, and most of the time it was me paying for it, believe it or not, and I couldn't. I know, I know. Oh, they don't only worry, had that okay. CD out at that yeah. time called Juice. Oh. Know the Ledge? Remember yeah. that was their last What's that CD? word when you're busting loose? I know. Don't worry. It's okay. And See, I'm glad now, now you, feel, you feel a lot better that you got that out of you. No, let me just add one more thing oh, no to make me the no ultimate problem. sucker. Please, continue. Please. I would always be forced to go downtown, oh. girls. Oh. Oh. Wendy got smarted. Wendy got smarted. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's never go downtown, not even once. Oh, oh my God. So, in other uh, words, you were you used to this saying, oh. <laughs> yeah, yeah, and not only that, but it'd be happening like 3 o'clock in the morning. Oh, sweaty nut. But you, and, it, but you, and it would happen off the basis of a of a cell, of a of a beeper call. Oh, not even me, a house phone. I mean, you know what I'm saying? Oh, let me ask let me ask you. Let me ask you one question, Wendy. Oh, did, did you, you did you swallow it or did you spit it out? You know what? No. I don't really. I don't remember because no. I like oh, to block don't you, off. Oh, oh. you know, you remember. Are, Can't nobody right. forget that. Chances are, if you ask, well, no, do don't leave my patient. Forget, this is my patient. I'm sorry. She does have good hair, though. <laughs> <laughs> Look, her skin you, is clear. If you do it enough, if you do it enough, you, you tend to forget. Exactly. And that's number one. And number two, if you ask, chances are I probably did it. Now, don't uh -huh. you feel? Don't you feel a good? A good? Don't you feel real good about yourself now that you let that out? Woo. Yeah, I do. Hey, I feel good oftentimes thing. people have me twisted into the being this, you know, this this wild woman who might be strong and bossy and all like that. And really, we're all we all have our weaknesses. Yeah, and we all have our stupid stories from mm -hmm. our past. And I'm just thankful that I've smartened up and that I have a better man in my life at this particular point. That's right. Wow. And you know what I'm saying? And you're leading a better life right now. A much better life. And you know what he's doing? Sleep. I don't know. 
<laughs> hey, you know, you know, behind your confession, we got somebody on the phone right now.